we need to encourage them because how uh, kopi mtiani mara nyingi watu wengi huwa wanaogopa ni results mara nyingi vitu ambavyo watu huwa wanaogopa ni nini ni results watu waogopangi mtiani all the same how are you god bless you whatever you are going to work on it is part of the transition process in life transitions moving from one level to another and every level has its recommendation has its way of life has its character every level of life has an expectation from you wana sifiwe so god is calling us into levels john chapter 15 verse 1 said i am the true vine and my father in heaven he is the vine dresser vine dresser ni ule mkulima anayepalilia hiyo mzabibu yesu ni mzabibu and jesus says you are the branches on me and he says any branch that does not bear fruit god will cut you away from the body of jesus but that which beareth fruit god will prune that branch which is you that you may bear more fruit there is a difference between cutting and pruning when we cut we might use either a panga a knife we cut because we don't need it we cut with a mentality here look at me with a mentality here that we have nothing to lose when we lose you but pruning we use something we call it in agriculture subject which you are yet to start learning we call it secatuas aina fulani ya makasi now both cutting and pruning they are painful but the difference is brought about after the activity now pruning is part of the process because you must bear fruit if you don't bear fruit unakosana na mungu if you become a fool in school unakosana na mungu so at some point god wants to be proud of you parents want to be proud of you hallelujah now part of the process of what are the other is called the transition process will involve pruning which is the discipline mom gives you at home the punishment dad gives you sometimes you are rebuked sometimes the teacher just chastises you are we together and also part of the process for you to qualify where the next step will involve the exam because at every level we have to be tested another exam will come another exam will come another one will come and another will come and finally part of this process of transition will involve whether you will fit there or not whether you will qualify there or not it will involve your character and your character is shaped mostly by the people within the surroundings it is shaped by what goes through inside of you through what our other is called the input devices your eyes your nose your ears they are input devices the content you see how are you how many of you know teacher afro tell me the truth yes yes now if you know teacher afro parents you can be sure teacher afro is a mender <laughs> and what is coming from the mouth of teacher afro it is part of what could either be shaping or affecting what you are shaping in your children are we together what you listen to jesus offers you the best example he had hundreds of followers 
but he discovered there are things he could not do with the hundreds. He noticed there are things he could only do with the 72. Akafukuza wengine akasema ah hii mahali ninaenda nataka 72. Ah and of the 72 akafika pale akasema hapana I need 12. And of this 12 ah ah kuna mtu lazima afanye namna gani? Anisaliti. And out of the 11 there are 3 who are supposed to witness the transfiguration. And this what we witnessing the transfiguration. They witness it at a different level. Mutu asi kwambia tunatoshana. We are not the same. Mandika na tuambia. And each one of us. Atavi kwa taji. Na baba. Sawa sawa na nini? Na matendo yake. Na jinsi alivyo tempea na mungu. Hapa duniani. Ambao kuvikuwa, I'm talking based on the commitment, availability, a teachable spirit, our involvement in the manners of seeking God. Because he says, seek and you shall find. When we seek him, he reveals himself. So how he reveals himself to you is not how he reveals himself to me. Bidiyako. Sometimes we go to churches where a member has a revelation of God better than even the, the leader on the altar. Because this is a personal thing. Are we together? Now finally, I, I'm assuring you, you are blessed of God. And you are going to make it. God relates with us through what we call principles. Principles would mean kwa kiswahili kanuni. But in English, it would still be interpreted as what you call law. Laws would mean conditions. A condition is what you have to do for me to be able and it shall be given. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called children of God. For you to qualify to be a child of God, you have to identify yourself with this element, peacemaking. So there is a condition. W women, women, submit. And then when you submit, you will get what you call love. Love is not attracted by babe, oxygen, no. That oxygen can turn can turn into carbon monoxide one day. So the only way you can attract love in your marriage, submit. So it is a condition. And you men love your wives exactly as Christ has loved the church. So the best way you can learn how to love her is not when you attend many conferences. It is when you attend and seek to know Exactly as Paul says, my desire is that I may know him and the power that raised Christ because when he reveals himself to you, that is when you <laughs> boys and girls there is a condition that God wanted you to fulfill and the condition was in Ephesians 6 verse 1 to 3 and you children honor your father and mother for it is a right thing to do a first commandment that comes with a promise and what is the promise they are in they are two number one that you may live a long life long life is not brought about by prayer Pastor, That's where your blessing is. Wait, don't you are not created to bless them? Excuse me, they are created to bless you. You cannot cast them even by prayer. You can't. The Lord does not allow. Praise the Lord. Just do it. Talk to it. Send it. You will be prosperous. And the second condition for you to get long life. After, after long life. The second condition he says that it may be well with you. 
there are people they are number one number one number one number one but when they come to the last pepper they become number 84 out of 84.5 because it is not well with them kuna mwingine anasoma na maliza university wakati amepata mshahara wake wa kwanza akitoka quick mart supermarket baada ya kuclean shelf anaenda kwa nyumba na shopping akicross barabara anagongwa na baiskeli na anakufa because it is not well kuna mtu anasoma anapata kazi kubwa anapata pesa mingi ananunua shamba na jenga nyumba baada ya kununua shamba na kujenga nyumba inakuwa realized ya kwamba shamba alinunua ilikuwa mbaya inapotea because it is not well but now because you have fulfilled that condition i want to bless you because you have fulfilled that condition you have met Deuteronomy 28 verse 13 to come true and what does it say he says i will make you the head and not the tail go face that paper without fear face that paper no god is with you when as if you will excellence is the spirit of god we are baptizing you right now your parents are wishing you well your family members are wishing you well transforming grace is blessing you no you have god exactly like david go face that paper come back home glorious let us celebrate you and you are going to the next level you are going there and we will support you father i thank you somebody stand up as parents as parents eh, number 627 nimekwambia ya kwamba na wewe kama mzazi utatamuka jina la Mungu juu ya watoto wako na hao watoto Mungu atachukua usukani kwa miaka yote nimetumikia Mungu sijawahi ona mtu ambaye yuko under the control of God ambaye amekuja chini ama nyumbani na less than enough ama is operating under the glory we bless them mention the name of Jesus upon these children let God take control mababu na watu waliokufa kwa damu ya kwao pasipo kuna wili katika chochote katika masomo mahala popote tutatangaza katika jina la Yesu katika majira haya haya madabau na damu ya Yesu vinawatenganisha na maisha ya watoto hawa katika jina la Yesu Kristo excellence is resting over these children in the name of Jesus the Christ of God as they go through this process of transition they are qualified Paul tells Timothy seek yourself to be an approved workman that does not need to be ashamed before both God and men tonight in the name of Jesus and Father I receive these children as my own yes. and start in place oh god as a high priest over them oh god in agreement with their parents and also the pastors and god fearing servants in this house in the midst of this members of this ministry as many witnesses of the gospel of grace we declare together in the name of jesus and that the alpha who is god that began the process of knowledge shall order in himself over them exactly as Paul has taught in 1 Corinthians 14:15 and that I will serve worship sing praise and live in this life in the spirit yes but I will also do it with understanding which comes as a result of the acquisition of knowledge knowledge is power knowledge is deliverance mandiko yanasema eye kwamba na watu wangu wanaangamia kwa ajili ya kukosa maarifa kwa sababu mayakataa maarifa hata pia na mimi ninakukataa kama Mungu wako hiyo basi maarifa ni mapenzi ya Mungu knowledge is the will of God knowledge is a sword of deliverance by this world of knowledge over your life it shall be well with your life you shall excel in every aspect of your life upon this 
children of all God. I speak a sound mind. A sound mind. Na keme ama rosa kulala. Uchofu wa mwili. Kuvunchika kwa mwili. Mausikizi za hapa na pale. Maukolchu wa darasani. Confusion from the world of darkness. I rebuke it right now. In the name of Jesus. Every agenda of the wicked one. And be it from the family members. And be it from the neighbors. Be it from the wandering spirits. Father, I destroy it in time. In the name of Jesus. Na wandalia njia. Nendeni mukapenge. Nendeni mukafaulu. May you go and bring home of victory. For I have blessed you. In the name of the Father. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. Be well with you. Let it be well with you. Let it be well with you. In the name of Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Go and make it. Go and make it. Come home victorious. Go make it. Come home victorious. My goodness. Go make it. Come home victorious. Come home victorious. Come home victorious. Thank you. God bless you. Go make it. And come home victorious. Go make it. And come home victorious. Go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Go make it. And come home victorious. Atakukedisha na 